good morning from Cuba, New Mexico. Um, you can see there's a house here in the background. And the reason for that is we stayed there last night, uh, Mark, uh, Alan, and myself. And that's because um, we were coming into Cuba yesterday and we, you know, the camping options are not great. Uh, and accommodate, there's a couple of motels, didn't want a motel. So I posted something on Facebook about camping in the area. And uh, among the really good su suggestions, uh, a woman, a local woman who was away for a couple of days, um, asked me to uh, direct message her, and I did. And she said that she's away for a couple of days, as I said, and she said, go and stay at my house. So that's what we did. Um, she gave us directions and a uh, really, really nice person. I mean, it's just this sort of thing is just, it's, it's part of what doing this sort of thing is all about. Um, you know, people helping people, um, you know, um, you know, bicycle tours, helping bicycle tourists. Um, yeah, I mean, I've done it. I'm a warm showers host. Uh, I've stayed at other warm showers. I've had this in the past in Nuvik last year. The same thing happened. So, but yeah, so this is the house that she allowed us to stay in last night and it was really comfortable, very spacious. Um, and we're very, very much appreciative. So, um, anyways, plan is to head off into the desert today. Uh, we're going towards Grants. We're probably, we won't make it there today. We'll make it there tomorrow. We've got a hostel booked, um, but for for today, uh, we'll be camping out in the desert. Now, my front tire has been losing air slowly the last day or so, so um, I'm going to keep an eye on that. But I just I think if I just keep pumping it up, uh, I think it should be fine. So anyways, more on that up the road. But uh, right now, um, Mark and Alan are at the McDonald's, and I'm going to go and join them. Uh, and I'm going to grab a bottle of wine, bring it back put it here for for our our uh, the kind woman who let us use her house and um, yeah and then we'll be on the way we'll be on our way <laughs> anyways it's early see you down the road First 20 kilometers or so out of uh, Cuba is all paved, and it's predominantly downhill, so it's a nice, uh, it's a nice run. But uh, we're getting pretty close to the cutoff here, where I go off into the wilderness, and with this really, really slow leak in the front tire, I'm betting, <laughs> hoping um, that you know all I'll have to do. Worst case scenario is just stop and you know add some air every so often. Uh, seems to be fine. Um, you know I filled it up. Still, you know, still good. I filled it up at the house and rode around. At breakfast and got just before I left town. I checked the tire pressure again. It was right around where I had filled it up this morning at the house. So I don't know if that's a good sign. Um, but there are no uh, there are no bike shops in, in Grants uh, or anything south of well south of the last bicycle shop. So yeah, I guess this is what adventure is all about. Got a few little tricks up my sleeve that I can check, um, you know, in case I run into huge problems. Um, but you know, that's just the way it goes. I think I'll be okay. I'm confident. I'll. Cut off. Coming very, very shortly. Okay, here it is.
past the grate. And there we be. And there it is. To stop, take my jacket off, uh, have a little sip of water, um, and then move on. So, hopefully no rain. Hopefully this is going to be a nice ride. We'll see you out there. Cowboys when they're when they're hurting them it seems to work. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Funny. Yeah. I'm glad they're timid because they're very large animals. And I get so close to them sometimes it scares me that, you know, he'll just get the wrong idea and just bolt at me. You know, just take one good hit, but, and I'm done. Anyways, see you down the road. tailwind and uh, getting a bit of a spritz from the edge of that cell but uh, I think we'll be able to to I don't know outrace it okay anyways see you up the road
this is the desert. Um, water is kind of hard to come by, so there are some POIs on the app that show where water is, and this one is about a mile off the route, but it's shown as reliable, so we're going to take advantage.